bought him suit because he was skinnier than he is now. Yeah. And he played, we played ball with fellas that were five times our size. That's right. And I don't know what it was, but when Williams is doing a punt return, <laughs> he was slippery as grease. Amen. <laughs> And he probably was maybe 100 pounds or 95. <laughs> Very and get hit by someone that's 250. Yeah. And Williams will bounce off of him. <laughs> yeah, hit him. Yeah, be like a pin paw. He'll bounce off them, bounce off somebody else, put his tongue to the side, and stand <laughs> on his feet. That's right. <laughs> That's right. Soup, slippery. Amen. Made his escape. <laughs> Amen. The greatest day of your life that's given to you from God. Yeah. When you make your make escape. Your escape. Yeah. Now right. God got a warning. That's right. To everybody. Amen. That were baptized in the name of Jesus Christ and did not continue to walk the holy path. That's it. Even if you receive the Holy Ghost That's right. speaking in tongues, yeah. but did not continue, continue in God's holy way. That's right. Look at clearly, glory to God, of what the Lord said. Back in 2 Peter chapter 2 and verse 20. What is it? For if after they have escaped the pollutions of the world through the knowledge of the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Information hmm. is how we made our escape. That's right. right. Information is what freed us. Hallelujah. That's right. Being blind with that fake salvation of bowing head, raising hands, <laughs> joining churches, and Father, Son, and Holy Ghost baptism. That's right. Praying a sinner's prayer. Yeah. Going to a Catholic church and getting sprinkled. Yeah. All that pollution. pollution. Holy Ghost, but no speaking in tongue. That's right. Air pollution. Yeah. God come through and by the word. Rescue us. They have escaped. They have escaped. The pollutions of the, the world. The pollutions of the world. Through the knowledge of the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. What happened? They are again entangled therein. They are, they are again. Entangled therein. They got entangled. They went right, right back. That's right. And the same trash they were in. That's right. And when he got in it, how deep are they in it, William? And overcome. It took them over. That's right. They got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Came out the woman preacher church, come and got baptized, went right back on the woman bishop. Amen. Got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, went right back to a church that fight the Holy Ghost speaking in tongues. That's right. Got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, went right back with Trinitarianism. Amen. Got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, and now went right back to a church that fly a rainbow flag. My Lord. Came to holiness, got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, went right back in a man made religion that's nowhere in the Bible. They are again entangled therein. You went back and got entangled therein. And overcome. And the devil took you over. That's went, right. Got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ and went right back living together, not married. That's right. That's right. Why did you get baptized? What? Mm -hmm. That's right. The Bible says repent. Repent and be baptized. Oh, God, you got to repent of your sins. Gotta repent. That's right. Don't you know when you repent and are baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. you signed a contract between you and God? That's right. I want to say what? Six chapter of the Romans. book of Romans. Romans chapter six will start at You one. signed a death contract. That's right. Between you and God. Amen. What do you mean, Pastor Jennings? You agreed mm. to die. Amen. Die what? You have agreed Hallelujah. to die Hallelujah. from your sinful actions. That's right. You won't stop your sin overnight, but you agree to it. Yes. I want to educate you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I want you to know what this thing is all about. Amen. Sixth chapter of Romans says what? What shall we say then? What shall we say then? Shall we continue in sin that grace may abound? It is not the will of God 
for you to continue in sin. How do God feel about the continuation of sin? God forbid. God forbid. How shall we that, How are, dead shall we that are dead to sin live any longer therein? Stay in it. Know you not? That so many of us as were baptized into Jesus Christ what is it? were baptized into his death. Hmm. See, when you baptize in the name of Jesus Christ, Amen. You baptize into in, his death. Into his death. You agreed to die. That's right. Glory to God and God got a message here. That's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That will kill you so you can stay dead. That's right. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Blessed be God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This lightweight religion. Yes. It's not designed. Hallelujah. To put your flesh to death. No. Hallelujah. The religion of men is designed to keep you living in sin. That's right. That's why so many false prophets is fighting holiness. That's right. The devil don't want you to be holy. The devil wants you to be everything Anything. that's not holy. Because when you're Baptist, Methodist, Presbyterian, and Lutheran, and all these man-made religion, yeah. you will never be what God wants you to be with that religious pollution. That's right. That's right. Are you listening? No, you're not. No, you're not. That so many of us as were baptized into Jesus Christ were baptized into his death. What yeah. is it? Therefore, we are buried with him by baptism. Wait a minute. Hmm. We are buried with him by, by baptism to what? Into death. Why? That like as Christ was raised up from the dead. How should we come up? By the glory of the Father. We also should walk in newness of life. So you signed a pact. Yes. An agreement. That's right. Lord. Hallelujah. I am going to strive. Yeah. That's right. Oh, yes. Should walk. Just stay out of sin. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. 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 Sign a contract. Yeah. Hallelujah. Lord, Hallelujah. I'm going to strive. strive. Hallelujah. That's right. Amen. That's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God wants you to come over here with him. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If after. For if after you have escaped the pollutions of the world. Verse again. Back in 2 Peter chapter 2, we're at verse 20. You escaped that beer drinking. Amen. Partying. God done took you off the party floor. Mm -hmm. Took you out the club. Yeah. You came and got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ and went right back with your buddies. That's right. Many of you watching me now, you're watching here, 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 hard hit, because you're guilty. Yeah. Well, Pastor Jesus, I'm baptized, and you're still, this is the warning. That's this right. is the warning. You're baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, yeah. but because you didn't continue, continue in the holy way of God, that's right. you still that's right. on your way to hell, that's right. just like one that never got baptized. Acts chapter 2 and at verse 42. What do everybody got to do after they obey this? And they continue. They continue. Steadfastly. You got to keep it up. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Continue. That's right. Even if you're baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. That's right. But if you don't continue with God, mm -hmm. you will still go to yes. hell That's right. like a sinner that never obeyed him. That's right. That's right. Amen. The warning is so great. It's great. And so strong. Yeah. You better go back to Peter. Ba back in 2 Peter 2 and verse 20. I want to show you how strong hmm. and how intense. Yeah. This warning is for if after they have escaped the pollutions, have escaped of, the world, the pollutions of the world through the through knowledge, knowledge of the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, they are again entangled therein, and then again you are entangled therein, and overcome. And that thing overtook you. Look how God feels. The latter end, your last end, is worse, is worse with him than the beginning. Your ending will be worse than your beginning. That's right. What else did for, he say? For it had been better for it them. Is Better for you not to have known the way of righteousness. To have known this information. Then after they have known then it, to have known it, to turn from the holy commandment delivered unto them. Amen. Hallelujah. 
Hallelujah. It had been better for them not to have known the way of righteousness. God Hallelujah. spoke this to me this morning. Mm. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Hey Amen. I was getting my clothes ready. Yeah. Mm. Ironing my pants and whatnot to my suit. Hallelujah. Holy Ghost brought this to me. Hallelujah. Hey Amen. While standing at the ironing board, I felt the Spirit of God came over me so strong until he brought tears to my Hallelujah. eyes. Hallelujah. My Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. This is a warning. Hallelujah. 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 Even if you obey. Yes. Acts 238. Yeah. That's not enough. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. God wants more out of you. That's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I say God want more out of you. That's right. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. Hallelujah. I listen to the old man. For it had been better for them not God to have known. Said it is better you never knew it. Not to have known the way of than righteousness. To know, not to know the way of what? The way of righteousness. God says better you never knew what's right. Then after they had then known after it. after you have known it. To turn. Then you turn. From the holy commandment. From what he commanded. Delivered unto them. And the Bible says he commanded all men everywhere to, to repent. repent. That's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's better you haven't heard it than after they have known it to turn Hallelujah. from the holy commandment to live it unto them. Better you haven't heard it. That's right. Mm. We have baptized thousands. Oh, yes. Thousands. Oh, yeah. Thousands. That's right. That's right. Many of you that were baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Didn't seek the Lord for the Holy Ghost at all. That's right. Got your baptism. Went right back out there drinking and smoking and still died in sin. That's right. That's right. That's true. Got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Got hooked up with some woman. Yeah. Who already got a husband. And you turned your back on the commandment of God Turn. and married her anyway. That's right. It had been better for them not to have known the way of that you haven't heard this message. Then after they have then known it. after you hear this message. To turn. And you turn. From the holy commandment from to live unto them. the holy commandment that's being brought to you now. But this is a holy order. That, that's right. That's right. This is a holy order. Holy. Amen. Amen. Many of you out there now looking at me were baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ, yeah. sister. Now you got your pants back on. Yeah. That's true. Got your hair extensions again. Amen. Back out there with your makeup on and fake fingernails. That's right. Back out there half naked with the name of Jesus Christ on you. That's right. That's right. Many of you men went down in water in the name of Jesus Christ. Now you're swishing like a girl. Amen. That's true. Yeah. You got married to a man after, after you got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. That's right. That's right. It's better you never known it. It had been better for them not to have known the it's way of righteousness. It's better for them you haven't known it. Amen. Many of you preachers were baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. But you couldn't turn down that money. Right. You sold your soul for money. That's oh, right. Yes. Until you valued those dollars more than the baptism in the name of Jesus Christ. That's and right. you sold your soul and turned your back on God's word. That's right. It is better. It had been better for them not to have known the way of righteousness. That you have known this right way. Than after they had known. Many of you R&B singers yeah. and entertainers were baptized. Amen. Amen. In water, in the name of Jesus Christ, and actually had the Holy Ghost speaking in tongues. My Lord. Glory to God, but because there uh. you wasn't making enough money. Yeah. You yeah. sold your soul, and now look at you. Singing for the devil, dancing for the devil, popping your fingers for the devil, bumping and That's grinding right. for the devil. That's right. That's right. And when someone brings the name of Jesus Christ, you cuss. Yeah. Because your love for money have given you such a hate for God. That's right. 
And now you got your mansion, you got your fleet of cars, yeah. and you think you're prosperous? Yes. But here's a warning. Amen. From your Lord. For it has been better for them not to have known the way. It is like better. You. Amen. That you haven't known this right way. Then after they have known it. Then to have known it. To turn. From the holy commandment to When you unto turn them. from God's commandment, you commit treason against him. That's right. That's right. Listen, let me bring it like this to you. Amen. When you've been introduced to God's way, yeah. and then you turn your back on God, on God. and pick up some other religion, yeah. you cheated on him. That's right. Mm. That's right. That's right. Like a woman cheat on her husband, like a man cheat That's on right. his wife. Yeah. You have cheated on God. That's, That's right. what Israel done. That's right. That's right. Israel cheated. Cheated. On God. As a wife treacherously. Listen. In the book of Jeremiah chapter 3 and at verse 20. Let's get by before this. Jeremiah chapter 3 and at as verse a, 20. As a wife treacherously, treacherously. Departed from her husband. Leave her husband. So have ye dealt treacherously so with me. So have God say so have you dealt treacherously. With me. Whenever you leave God for a man, for a woman, Amen. for money, for popularity, for notoriety, Amen. for some fake religion, you are dealing treacherously, treacherously. against God That's and right. your life is in danger. That's right. That's right. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. Oh. Hallelujah. I'm warning you now. As a wife. Yeah, you can hate me all you want. I won't lose a drop of sleep over oh, your head. No. Amen. Thank God we're not a sellout. That's right. You can't offer me nothing. That's right. I say nothing. That's wonderful. So I said everybody got a price. <laughs> not here. That's right. I'm nobody's whore. No. I've been bought already. That's right. Jesus shed blood. Yeah. Purchased us. Purchased. Until the word of God say you're bought with a price. The price. That's right. Got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. That's right. Look at what you sold out on God for. Mm. Crack. Yeah. Pot. Cigarettes. Oh, yeah. Smoking pipes. Vaping. A girl. That's right. A boy. That's right. Money. Amen. Cars. Mm -hmm. Entertainment. Yeah. Clubs. Partying. Right. Amen. It had been better for them not. Many of you preachers that's in the pulpit, you're baptized in the name of Jesus Christ years ago. Yeah. Received the Holy Ghost speaking in tongue years ago. Yeah. But now you decide to push it aside and now promote non-denominational <laughs> because they got you on payroll. That's right. That's right. It's better you never known it. Where it had been better for them not to have known the way of this righteousness. This is a warning from heaven. Amen. It is better. It had been better you for them. You have not known. The way of righteousness. The way of righteousness. Then after they had known then it. after you knew about it. To turn. You turn. From the holy commandment delivered unto when them. When you turn on God, you're dealing treacherously, treacherously with him. That's right. And now when you turn on him, he categorized you in the, as two animals. Back in 2 Peter chapter 2 at verse 22. When you turn on God. That's right. He put you in the category of two animals. Dirty animals. That's right. Not Pastor Jennings. No. I said, yeah, 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 yeah. Not Pastor Jennings, stiff neck, <laughs> hard head. God. God. Listen at this. Second Peter 2 and at verse 22. And I'm going to tell you why he used these two animals. But it has happened unto them according to the true proverb. They turned their back. They commit treason. Yeah. They went back on God. Just mm -hmm. like he said, according to the true proverb, what do he call them? The dog. What? The dog. Oh, is turned to his own vomit again. Notice. The reason why I call you a dog, a dog. Because a dog nature is the love filth. And the dog always go back to filth. That's right. The dog will vomit in the vomit. street. Yeah. And then lick his vomit. Oh yeah. That's true. That's right. The dog would drop dung in the street. That's right. And go back and eat it. Mm -hmm. That's right. Huh? It has happened unto them. In other words, a dog don't care. 
Yeah. What goes in his mouth. That's right. That's right. And many of you out there got the same attitude. That's right. You don't care what come out of the preacher's mouth. Yeah. As long as it make you happy, as long as he don't offend you, and as long as he don't speak against any form of sin you're in. That's right. That's why you hate Pastor Jennings. <laughs> Because I won't let you pet me. <laughs> oh, no. No. That's hey, right. I won't let you. You know, you can pet a dog. Yeah. They want to pet Pastor Jennings. <laughs> I've been offered church organizations. I've been offered cars. I've been offered millions of dollars. Yeah. I take all those offers highly offensive. That's right. That's right. Why? That's right. There's nothing nobody can offer me that can compare to what I already have. Amen. Thank God I got the greater thing. That's right. And I, the greater thing is God himself. Amen. Huh? But it has happened unto them. It has happened unto them. According, according to the true proverb. To the true proverb. The dog is turned. Have turned. To his own vomit again. To his own vomit again. And the sow. And the pig. That was washed. That was washed. Who are wallowing in the mire. When you repent of your sins. And were baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. God washed that pig. Wash. That's right. That's right. That pig was washed. Washed. Amen. Amen. That's true. But I don't care if you clean up a natural pig to put it in the show. <laughs> you leave that gate open where there's a mud hole. <laughs> Amen. He gonna run right to it. That's right. That's right. Viewers, I've said in time past, and I say again, mm -hmm. God don't owe you nothing. No. God don't owe you anything. No, no. You owe God your whole being. That's right. You owe God your whole life. That's right. But look at how you treat him. Amen. You hear the word of God preached. And you say you repent. And many of you did. Yeah. You come go down in water in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. And after you get this gift. Yes. The form of baptism. Yeah. And the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. You don't walk with God a good three hours. That's true. That's true. You go right out the water. Yeah. And the very same day. Yeah. Go back and live with your boyfriend. That's true. That's true. Go back and live with your girlfriend. This? You know, yeah, because somebody's going to pull the other. Right. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's right. And if you don't have God, what kind of resistance do you have? That's right. You may have moral resistance, hmm. but you need something stronger than morals because morals can be broken. That's right. That's true. Are you listening? That's right. That's right. I want to soak you a little. Now in the book of Jeremiah, chapter 4 and at verse 22. Says what? For my people is foolish. Yeah. Do you hear God complain? My people is foolish. My people, fools. They have not known me. They don't know me. They are sottish children. They are what? Sottish children. Sottish children. And they have none understanding. They don't have an understanding. Do you know the repercussions? Hmm. Do you know what you're doing when you deal treacherously, treacherously against your creator? That's right. You have committed treason. That's right. Sure. To take someone that commit treason against a country, they go to jail. Oh, yeah. You commit treason against God, you are go to hell. That's right. They are wise to do evil. What? They are wise to do evil. Do you hear this? Back in Jeremiah 3 and verse 22. They are smart. They are wise to do evil. To do evil. But to do good. But to do good. They have no knowledge. Viewers. Thousands of you have been baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And now denounce it. That's right. Yeah. Before I was born, they were doing this. That's right. Or it take God, but the alarm clock is here now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Many of you were baptized in the name of Jesus Christ of a truth. Mm -hmm. Now look at you watching me smoking. My Lord. Drinking. Gambling. Yeah. Now you're a stripper coming down a pole in some dingy club. <laughs> My Lord. My Lord. Amen. Giving a man a lap dance. Yeah. After you're baptized. Uh, that's right. That's right. 
Amen. Amen. Walk in the streets, prostituting mm. after you're baptized. Yeah. He driving around pimping after you're baptized. After they have escaped the pollutions Lord, of the world. God, yeah, 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 yeah. Back in 2 Peter 2 and verse 20. You know the devil don't want you to walk with God. No. no. Lord, take God, the devil don't want you to serve God at all. That's right. So you bear this thing in mind. The moment you make it up in your mind, you go and walk with God and give God service. Yeah. The devil's right there to try to keep you from doing it. That's right. Give me the book of Jasher. Mm -hmm. Give me Abraham. Mm -hmm. Amen. God Amen. commanded Abraham to offer up, you know, his son Isaac. That's right. And when Abraham was told to offer up Isaac, yeah. <laughs> the devil was nearby. Oh, yeah. They tried to stop the offering or the sacrifice from taking place. That's right. Listen at this now. In the book of Joshua chapter 23 and at verse 25. Follow me and get me. Joshua 23 and at verse 25. What is it? And whilst Abraham was proceeding with his son Isaac along the road, Satan came. Who came? Satan came. You know why you on the road? On the road. Hmm. On a journey towards God. Satan came. Who comes? Satan came. Sometimes Satan is fine, isn't he? Yeah. That's true. Satan come like a fox. Like a woman, and then you come like a wolf. That's right. Like a man. That's right. Get that brother fixated on that fox. Yeah. Amen. Yeah, Make him focus on the shape and the <laughs> smell of our old stinking perfume. That's right. Amen. Yeah, Amen. Yeah, Amen. Yeah, Amen. Make that sister fixated yeah. on that brother. Amen. Can't get past this hazel brown fake eyes. <laughs> That's right. Come on. That's true. And if he got street smarts, he can see the weakness in her. Yeah. So he'll get around her, act like he's looking for something, and pull out a wad of money. Yeah. Because he can see the lust hmm. for dollars in her eyes. That's right. And he use it as bait That's right. to lure her into hell. That's right. That's right. Are you listening to the old man? And whilst Abraham was proceeding with his son Abraham Isaac was along the road, with his son Isaac along the road, Satan came. Here come the devil. And appeared to Abraham in the figure of a very aged man. Wait a minute. Who came? Satan came. How did he come? And appeared to Abraham in the figure of a very aged man. Who came? Satan came. How did he come? In the figure of a very aged man. He come blending in. That's right. That's right. Some of you out there now that were baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. you met a fella in church. Mm. That's right. He went out with the devil, you went right with him. Amen. Many of you baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, brother, you met a sister in church. Yeah. Amen. Before you met that sister, you just couldn't stop huckabucking. <laughs> Jumping all between the pews, just huck a bucket. <laughs> That's right. Almost jumping around like Fred Astaire. <laughs> Almost like the Nicholas brothers. Yes. Oh, Lord. Spinning, twirling, yeah. throwing their hands behind their back jacket, just flying like James That's Brown right. Keep. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Amen. That's right. Until Miss Thing came by. Satan came. <laughs> That's right. Amen. Jezebel came A by. Amen. Had a Jezebel spirit. Yeah. With no jewelry on, no short dress, That's right. body fully covered, but Jezebel spirit was behind the modesty. That's right. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Amen. Amen. 